I am the king of Spotify playlisting, okay? For years, I've been vetting playlists to find ones that are real amongst a sea of frauds. And during my last search, I found a website called playlistify.io. Now, usually curators with a really nice looking website like this are the most suspicious, but the playlists associated with my search seemed legit, so I gave them a try. I spent 40 euros to get placed on some of the indie pop playlists that they have for my song, I Need a Light, which will be linked in the description. And they threw me onto these five different playlists. So I went ahead and tallied up all of the streams that I got from these five playlists and wow, I'm disappointed. I got a whopping 150 streams. That's about 30 cents per stream if you convert it to USD which is absolutely ridiculous. If you use something like Boost Collective, you'll actually get some solid streams. I'll make some videos on them in the future, but yeah, don't use Playlistify, at least for indie pop songs. They've got some stuff for rock, EDM and tech house and techno specifically. Surprisingly, no hip hop and rap, I don't know why. So maybe you'll have some better luck with these. I assume rock is their most prominent active genre of playlists, seeing as it's at the top of all of these. But who's to say? I guess on the bright side, they weren't fake streams, but man, I would love to see some better fucking results. Like the boys over at Boost Collective are putting like a couple thousand dollars a day to outbid people in playlist promotion and dude, the numbers. Woo. Stay tuned for that video in the future. But yeah, I thought I would check this out and give you guys a review just in case you were interested in trying them out.